talk about my favorite animal in the whole wide world. Can you guess? Okay, don't worry. I'm going to give you some clues. It's very big. It's very strong. It has big ears. And has the longer trunk than anybody else. Did you like this the magnificent elephant? Let's explore the species of elephants, the ancestors of elephants, and the evolution. So let's see where the word elephant comes from. The word elephant comes from Greek and Latin origins. The elephant scientific genus is Elephus. And in Greek linguistics, Elephus represents an antlered beast or stag. The root of the elephant is divided into two. Ele, which means arch, and pant, which means huge. Now let's uh, go back uh, to see where all the prehistoric elephants live in. To back, back up to the other which will be late for the prehistoric ride. About 50 to 60 million years ago, a um, a big sized prehistoric elephant appeared called Moratheria. It was the great 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 grandfather of the elephant. The first great grandfather of the elephant. Do you know in Manatees, Dugong are the closest living relatives of the elephant? Animals with trunk but are called Proboscidae, Elephantidae. The Asian elephant, the African elephant, and the woolly mammoth situate in this family of Elephantidae. This is in Trilopidae. It was 26 million years ago. It had four tusks. It had four tusks. Okay, so two tusks curved upward and two tusks curved downward. The Ethereum is this one. Has two uh, curved tusks but only over here. But mm, no, over here. No curved tusks over here. It's two uh, ter curved uh, tusks were only used for digging. Roots and also digging vegetation. Like roots. Or like beet roots. It exists as uh, mm, Approximately 26 million years ago, there no tusks in their upper jaw. That's it, that's why they look unusual. Now let's talk about the Platybelodon. This creature has two lower flattened tusks, again probably used for digging, uh, open vegetation up. Now let's just talk about the Mastodon. Mammoth is a family. They descended from Paleomastodon and they were found 25 billion years ago. Now let's go to the mammoth family. There are four types of mammoths. That's our imperial mammoth, woolly mammoth, and the Colombian mammoth, and the steppe mammoth. What we have here is the example of a woolly mammoth. It has fur and it has more ears than elephants. And has some some big tusks. The scientific name is Mammothus primigenius. The mammoth lives in in some snowy country. Aside from Platybelodon, Mastodon, woolly mammoth, it's from those cages. There's some species of elephant, like a macus. Stegotatrabelodon, Stegodon, Gompatherium, and Gompatier. Now let's go to two modern kinds of elephants, the African and the Asian. Now this is an Asian elephant, or Elephus maximus. It originated in Africa, but now are spread out throughout Eurasia. It existed in countries which like India, Sri Lanka, China, Bangladesh, and Southeast Asia. Do you know in an island in Sri Lanka, there is also some species of elephant 
called Elipus Maximus Maximus. Most of the uh, Elip most of the male elephants of that island don't have tusks. Do you know why most of the male elephants don't have any tusks at all? Because uh, they, because ivory hunters wanted the tusks. They needed ivory uh, to make uh, some kind of thing made of ivory. So they shot the elephants with large tusks. After that, they had just few babies. But interesting that human hunters uh, did also play in the evolution. Now this is an African elephant called uh, or Loxodent Africana. It appeared 1.5 million years ago. It is the newest elephant species of them all. It is different. The nation has because of its big ears, large size, and the fact that both males and females have tusks. Do you know why? Asian elephants are smaller, of smaller ears, and also the male only has tusks, not the female. This is the largest of the all elephants are the Serban or bush elephant. It is called the Loxodonta africana. The elephant that was smaller than Loxodonta africana uh, but was also African elephant that is also in Savannah but the darker savanna is Loxodonta cyclitis. It is the the upper naked forest elephant. So kids, now you learn about elephants again. Hope you had fun like me. Because I mentioned my video about elephants the first time I did it. This is Brando. The world's biggest elephant. Because can you see the big, really big and the huge most big size of him is making him the biggest elephant. If you like this video, share it with your friends. Signing off, this is Zayan and Brando. Bye-bye!